Black Friday. We are pulling into Walmart on Black Friday morning. There are a lot more cars here than they have been in the past for this time of day. I saw a picture on Facebook of the line here at midnight and the line and started at that door, went all the way down here, hi Ben. Hi. <laughs> and then went like all the way down here, down this way of the parking lot because you could see the storage buildings in the background. I was like, holy smokes. We, we are not looking for any big ticket items this year. No, sorry, I was looking at Tegan. Look at Tegan real quick. <laughs> you ready to go in? We're gonna have breakfast first. And then we're gonna look for movies. That's pretty much it, and toys. Toys and movies. Yeah. <laughs> and then we'll show you our movie haul when we come back out. When we get home. Yeah. <laughs> Anybody's looking for make a case, it's on clearance. If you, after, if you come here from seeing Ben's video. Yeah. <laughs> this video has really exploded lately for some reason. It has, and I followed the directions. Just saying that once, I followed the directions. Seriously. They got the big Little People Beauty and the Beast castle for $30. They got a bunch of Minion Daves over here for 20. What do you have, a picture frame? We haven't found the movies yet though. No. You're sure there's a big movie display, like the $1.96 ones and the three ninety six. ones. We have no idea where it is. We were too early for it last year, too. But we haven't seen anything yet. And for Infinity, they have some figures for $9. And the starter set for 37 which is actually a really good price. We finally found the movies. And they were down the dairy aisle. No wonder we would never have found them. Saw a balloon? Are you having fun on a Black Friday? It's really not crazy at all. No. <laughs> There's the most amount of people around the movies. <laughs> Where's the balloons, buddy? Oh. Oh. <laughs> so we had a good haul in there, found uh, quite a few movies. When we get home, we'll do a Blu-ray movie haul, like yeah. we do every year, except this will be the first year that our Blu-ray Black Friday haul is gonna be on our vlog channel. I know, it's usually on our main channel. We did one in 2012, 2013, 2014, <laughs> so this will be the fourth annual Black Friday Blu-ray haul here mm -hmm. on Ben's Toy Bin, but the first one on the family vlog. Yeah. We pretty much found everything we wanted to. We had to ask for a price match on Inside Out because Best Buy has it for $9.99 Blu-ray. And they have it for $19.96. Yeah, here. their regular so... price. So we had to jump through a couple hoops <laughs> to save $10, but they did approve it. They were nice enough to approve it. So yeah, it was a pretty good haul. We got some great movies, a lot of ones we hadn't seen yet that we wanted to. Yeah, so Tegan's uh, Blu-ray movie pick is gonna <laughs> have to start. Is Tegan's movie roulette segment yes. will uh, have to start <laughs> here soon. All right, we're on our way home. It's a beautiful day. It's it 54 gorgeous. degrees already. It feels like April or May out here today. So Holy we're gonna work moly. on Christmas decorations outside and last minute uh, winterization of the house. Of Bore, the house. A lot of boring stuff, but but Christmas decorations. And I get no, I didn't mean Christmas decorations <laughs> are boring. Like winterization is boring, but Christmas decorations <laughs> are not boring. And then uh, what else are we gonna do? What else are we gonna do? I don't know. I gotta do dishes. Yeah. Uh, do you guys, did any of you guys want to come over and do our dishes? <laughs> I'll save them for you. I dirty a lot of dishes when I'm cooking. <laughs> OMG, look at all those dishes I have to do. Oh boy. Okay, it's time for our annual movie Black Friday haul. Ready, Ben? Mm -hmm. First up, we have Inside Out. As you heard us talk about in the car, we actually asked if we could price match this because Best Buy had it for $9.99, and it was still regular price at Walmart. So after a little runaround, we saved that $10. Yes, we did. Continuing with the more recent movies that were $9.96 a piece, here is Dwayne The Rock Johnson in San Andreas. Hey, I can't wait to see that. We have a George Clooney in Disney's Tomorrowland, which we actually saw on the airplane ride to California this summer. We didn't see it in the theater, but it's a really good movie. If you haven't seen it, go check it out. Mm -hmm. It was surprisingly good. Next up, we have Disney's recent live action uh, Cinderella movie. We have Jurassic World. We've been, we were waiting for Black Friday to get this one because we had a feeling it would be $10 everywhere. And we were right. Okay, that was all the $10 ones we picked up. We also got Dawn of the Planet of the Apes. I think this was among the 696 titles on Blu-ray. I think so, I think so. I can't remember. We were just grabbing them. <laughs> yeah, I think this was a 696 one. We haven't seen this one. This is the second of the new Planet of the Apes. Mm -hmm. 
it drives Ben crazy how the titles are like something <laughs> of the something <laughs> of the two dollars or one ninety six. We have Space Jam, little nineties nostalgia there. Mm -hmm. We got Scooby Doo, Mask of the Blue Falcon, the all new original movie. Well, I'm sure it's not new anymore, but <laughs> it's new to us and Tegan, and it was one ninety six. We have Epic from Blue Sky, the creators of Ice Age. We never saw this one. I remember the Happy Meal about it, but we never actually saw the movie. I bet Ben doesn't even remember the Happy Meal. I do a little bit. Terminator Genesis. Okay, I don't remember what the orange tag was, but it wasn't I think too... that was a 996 movie. Yeah, it's so recent. This came out over the summer. And we also have Mockingjay Part 1 of The Hunger Games. I know part two just opened, but this is the Hunger Games that we hadn't seen. Mm -hmm. After a little bit of debate between the two of us, we determined this was the one we hadn't seen yet. Yeah, I think so. So that's it. That's our Walmart Blu-ray haul. We never would have found those movies. You saw they were in the dairy section. <laughs> yeah, who puts movies in the dairy section? Walmart does. That's who. <laughs> Crazy. Because we had the same problem last year. We couldn't find the big movie display anywhere. Now we know where they were. Yeah. We, they we were didn't, with the yogurt. We didn't think to look in the yogurt <laughs> and the cheese aisle. So, yeah. That's our Blu-ray haul. Can't wait to watch some of these over the winter. Catch up on the movies we missed this summer. Mm -hmm. Let us know down in the comments if you had a movie haul, Blu-ray haul, or wh whatever deals you found on Black Friday this year. We also found some pajamas for Tegan. A picture frame, some boring stuff. Not a lot of <laughs> toy bargains jumped out at us. No, nothing that nothing that we really needed to get, that's for sure. What movie do you want to watch first, Onyx? I wonder what his little emotions are doing right now. <laughs> I don't know. I think it's probably disgust. This one right here? <laughs> yes. <laughs> I'm going outside. <laughs> so I spent a little bit of time today working on Christmas outside because it was so nice out. I have our candy canes and there is Winnie the Pooh with a pot of honey. We have our Christmas flag. This thing is supposed to light up but maybe I didn't have it out early enough. I'm not really sure. This says Merry Christmas. There's a wreath that goes right here but I have to uh, reattach it right there and I got our lights up over here this is our woodshed if you ever wondered what this is this is where we keep all of our wood for the fire and then I got some lights back here on the back steps and these peppermint candy cane things they light up when it gets dark enough they're solar powered and down here and down here closer to the road I have some gold bells lit up on a post and I don't know if you can see through the trees let me zoom in there are some Christmas lights down there because that is a Christmas tree all lit up it's on the side of the road <laughs> so that you can see it down there you go up the hill and their trees have been cleared because we had a tornado come through and you can see the lit up Christmas tree right there pretty much from the top of the hill I like it. Looks like some of my lights are burnt out though, so I might have to fix that. But at least I have part of it up. And then the rest of the deck, I think I'm gonna put lights. I just didn't get around to it today, but I'm gonna put lights around this part of the deck, around the stairs, around the archway, and down there. So we'll be all Christmas up outside. Say good night, Pooh. Good night. In case anyone was on the edge of their seat until the end of this video to see if I got the dishes done, I did. They're all clean. I'm just soaking those two cans. But other than that, all the dishes are clean. Go, John. Go, John. Very productive. It's been a very productive day. Wouldn't you agree, Daisy? She's saying bye. We'll see you tomorrow.